Warning, the game in this Let's Play is rated M for Mature. Viewer discretion is advised. Hello everybody, welcome back to the final chapter of A Plague Tale. Innocence, the game has actually ended. We ended it last chapter. This is the epilogue, so welcome to the epilogue. So I'm just going right into it. I just f finished the last chapter. I'm going right into this, so we're not getting any introduction or into it. So just you need to know, uh, what was her name? I forgot the name of the really old lady in the beginning of the series. She just handed us something that looked like money, possibly something else. And Lucas needed it. So we're going to go drop it off to Lucas. I forgot what it was. That's really all that's happened so far in this epilogue. So let's continue. Oh, it would probably be very helpful if you could see. Okay. This is really pretty. Look at that blue sky with the clouds. I love looking at the skies. Oh, nice. This looks actually looks like I could look outside and see that. Not it's nighttime now, but um, like it's winter time, so like this totally would match like the way it would look anytime this year where I live right now. So very realistic. Very realistic. I like it. I've all, I just want to say I love the design. You probably want me to just continue on and not, um... Okay, yeah, so, just, I have nothing with her. I was curious about that. Okay, so we're just going along. Yeah, I, I love the design of this game. A lot. I love the medieval area. Not area. The medieval era. Uh -huh. Sorry. <laughs> And I do like looking, at, like I said, I said in the beginning of the series, I love looking at the backgrounds and stuff, especially, like, like I said, during this era, there's not, like, a lot of, there's not a lot in the background, it's not too busy, it's, it's nature, like, that's really beautiful, and that's phenomenal, that's, it's like, the sky's clear, I'll stop. I'll stop. So, what were you the able fuck to go that? home? Pig. Yes. The nest is still there, but it's empty. <sighs> I can't believe the rats are gone for good. Let's hope they are. So that's okay. I think these guys were talking. Yeah, these two ladies were talking. So the rats are gone. Three days later, the rats are gone. So I guess, yeah, once we killed Vitalis, oh, I guess. Oh, Mr. Look! Man, you want to try your hand at shooting? Not me. My sister's really good. Oh god, no, Why don't do this to me. Alright. Let's have a go. Good. Good. No, it's the rule is it's simple. Just like the first you have episode. Six stones, six possible shots. Try and shoot as many targets as possible. I'm not gonna be are ready. Do that, are you kidding me? Ready. Go on, Amicia. I choke. I got news for you, I don't see where the targets are. Whoa. Where's the next target? There he is. Where's the last target? There we go. I wasn't timed hey, on this one. You know how to do it. You want an apple. And all due respect. Hell yeah. <laughs> yes, Amicia, well done. The apple's for you, Hugo. You're That's my biggest nice. supporter. That's oh, nice. thanks. That's so I was cute. hungry. As always. Hey, today we're celebrating the third day without rats. There's a little fair down the street. Go take a look. A fair? A real fair? I've never seen a fair before. Hugo, Lucas is waiting for us. We should be getting back. Yeah. But it's a fair. Come on. Hugo. Oh, no, no, no. <laughs> but no, we no, can't no. stay long. Get back to Lucas. Have you guys learned anything? I'm going this way. We can rebuild the village. But there will still be empty houses. If the bite leaves us in peace, people will come back eventually. I know there's no threat. I'm still looking for items. I, it's, it's a habit. I, I do want to hear what everybody has to so say, though. So is it true? You're going to deliver grain. It's been three days since we've seen a rat. We have to get back to work. It's true that we don't see anyone in the fields anymore. What a misery. Precisely. The nobles, the lords. Do you think they'll get their hands dirty? Never. But they do have money. And if they want to eat, they'll have to pay us a lot more. Hey, but you're right. I'm telling you. 
Everything will change. The rats were a necessary evil. Yeah, tell that to the victim. I'm still gonna look around because I don't know if there's another, um, what do you call it, achievement. Like when I found Roderick's um, old neighborhood. So that's I'm still gonna explore a bit. And part of me really doesn't want this to end. I didn't expect the last episode, the, yeah, the last episode to be the end. And I'm not, yeah, so. The memories are flooding me now, the first episode. Let me go back to her house. After everything that happened with Leon, Leon the dog. Hey, look. Oh, that's the young boy. Yeah, the goose. Oh, no. No, no, but you just can't come in. But I couldn't remember what it was called. Because you can't, that's why. Oh wait, I'm not gonna do that yet. I wanna go down here a little bit. I do wanna explore. I don't know if there's any achievements to be had, but... Oh, uh, alright, I officially can't go any further. Goodness. So there must be a reason for that. So... Piggy! Weren't there pigs in the beginning of this series as well, I believe? Ah, oh, memories. Hey, is there a problem? Look, the problem is a kid and his sister are wanted around here by important people. And we, well, we, yeah. we just don't want any trouble here, you understand? I can see very well. Hugo, we have to go. He's looking out for them, that's cool. He didn't, like, rat him out or nothing. He just... What the fair? Come on. Oh, they're just standing around. I was wondering if you could see anything happening in the background. Yeah, okay, so that's pretty cool that the guy didn't like say, hey, they're here, I got them, come get them. He just said, you know, someone's looking for you guys, just just go, I don't want to. I can respect that. Not a narc. Not a snitch. There's a ladder and I have to try to get up there and I can't get past this guy. That's just the way I'm hey, you see a ladder, you but go up. The first one to arrive at the cart wins 20 apples. 20 apples? No. You'll never beat me. You can't run at me, right, so you have it this whole series. What? Here I see. Oh, yeah? Then on three. One. Two. What card three. are you talking about? Hey! She's not running. <laughs> there. See, I knew you could run at me, so you made my life a living hell. Those last few I'm episodes. I'm right behind you. You can't beat me. Oh, she's slowing down. I knew you had it in you. Man. She's still going faster even when she slows down. She's still All going right. fa faster All than right. she did during those fights. You won. Yes, 20 apples. Is that your way of saying not to stop and look around at anything? Because I'm still gonna turn around and look at stuff. Like I said, part of me doesn't want this to end. This was really cool. And the game, the new game is coming out. So it's not like I'm gonna have to wait too long. It's coming out this year. I love villages, like medieval villages, I love this. That's not letting me explore, and that's annoying. It's annoying, but it is what it is. Yeah, there's nothing to look at, okay. I mean, there's plenty to look at, there's just nothing to explore. I'm probably just wasting time. But, if this is, like, a shorter chapter, then I'm kind of... Extending it a bit by doing this. Yeah, the, the creators worked very hard. The devs, the yeah, the writers, everybody. This was really cool. The the actual artists for this is amazing. Is that Lucas? I just like walked right up to him and then I just turned around. I'm gonna go look at stuff. We made it, Lucas. Do you have everything? The St. John's what? The Hawthorne? The, all of it. Uh, Let's go. Ingredients. Good. Amicia? Yes? Why are they looking at me like that? Melly looked at me the same way. Then she left. Because she doesn't like me anymore. Mm. Hugo, she... She had other things to do. That's not true. But it doesn't matter. Run! <laughs> So, Melly left, and I don't know who that's, that is laying down. Is that the mom? 
Is she going to sleep much longer? She has to get her strength back. Bless you, With the herbs you bought, she'll soon be back on her feet. All right. Yeah, it's gotta be the mom. So Melly left. And, um... That, that goes with her character. I wish she had, like, gotten vengeance, You go. Though. What? Do you think I'm pretty? <laughs> You're ugly. Really <laughs> ugly. <laughs> ugly? Me? You look like a big fat fly. <gasps> a fly? Your own sister? Oh, such a slur requires punishment. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's a great way to end it. That's the best way to end this. Lucas! Hey! <laughs> Help! <laughs> the fly's attacking me! So that looks like, what is that, a house? A chateau of some sort? I can't see what the, oh, it's the ocean. Oh, they're going out to sea? Going to a new world? Are they going to, like, that, wait, so that's, they were in France though, so. So that ocean could really, a big thank you to all of Sobo Studio and our family members for their support during the development of this game. I'm not gonna read all of it. Yeah, okay, let this go. Oh, I'm blocking it. I think I'm safer there. Okay. I only blocked that first sentence, actually. But yeah, so... Insanely good. This series was. I started talking about it in the last chapter. I don't know how much of that, because I haven't edited it, so I just went right into this chapter. So I don't know how much of that I edited out. So I might repeat some stuff. It may overlap, it's just what's gonna happen. But this was such a phenomenal game. With the, with the story and with the design, I am a bit biased, because I do, like I said, love, love, love this time period. The medieval, the Middle Ages, is my favorite. It's a, I love the medieval ages and anything to do with it. So whether it's fantasy or legitimately historical, like this was more kind of on the fantasy side with the, with what happened with the rats. Whereas the other game I'm playing, Kingdom Come Deliverance, is very historical. Um, I think that's very realistic. So I like both of these games I appreciate so much because I just love the time period. So I get biased with that. So that's the cast right there. And, um, the one thing, obviously, like, the one like, thing that I feel like I wish happened at the end, obviously that everybody survived, which they didn't. That, that, that's just the way the game and the story went. But I do wish Melly had gotten some vengeance for what happened to her brother, especially since I think they were twins, right? And that's like a special bond that only twins understand from what I've been told. So... I really wish she had, like, done something about that, or we got to see that. Maybe she'll be back next time, I don't know. I know nothing. I haven't looked into this second game at all. So I have absolutely no clue what's going to happen, or who's going to be in it, if it's about the same characters or not. No idea. I don't even know when it's, um... What, at what point this year it comes out, whether it's going to, you know, we're in January, the towards the end of January, so I don't know. No idea what's coming out. I am looking forward to it. I'm kind of looking to see if, like, the dog is on there, like, I don't remember if the dog, the dog did have some, yeah, like, whimpers and, I think, barks. I wanted to see if they had it on there. I may have missed it, or they just didn't, yeah, they didn't show it, okay. Maybe it was just not an actual, like, dog they had there. Maybe it was just stock noise stock audio anyway I'm rambling 
I don't want to like not say anything about this, this part, but I, I also don't know what to say. Oh, Arthur and Roderick were performed with the mocap by the same person, mocap motion capture. Okay. So that was a wild ride. And I do, this is, it's unique. I've never played a game that relied on this much stealth. And I certainly don't remember a game that centered around rats being like a villain, one of the villain's enemies, like challenges to go up against. I don't, yeah, so I don't remember ever playing anything with rats. So I, I thought this was fresh. And there's my trophy urn, knights. That's probably the first achievement that's actually been shown that my face wasn't in front of. Yeah, we're stopping this, because this part is actually loud as hell. And, uh, yeah, so there's chapter selections. So, I can actually just do chapters over again now if there's something I missed. Because I've already played. This was my first playthrough, and now my second playthrough I'll play, obviously, off camera. And that's gonna be my completion walkthrough. That's usually what I do. So, now I don't have to do the whole game all over again. I can just pick a chapter. So if there's anything I missed, uh, any uh, achievements I need to get, I can now do separately at my own at my own leisure, and I don't have to have to go through the whole game again. Well, there you have it, guys. That is it. That is the end, the complete and total end of a Plague Tale, in a sense. Okay, so I have brought it up on my phone. I have brought it up. I did want to look up when the next one comes out. The next one is called uh, a play. I'm gonna blow up my. The phone is like reflecting my glasses really badly. Okay, so the next one is called a Plague Tale Requiem, and it is coming out this year, 2022. And as far as the release date goes, because I did look it up, and it, there's no release date yet, so we. No idea when it's coming out. Okay, so we have no clue as to what month will come out. So it, <laughs> there's a chance it won't come out till December. We have to wait all year. But I cannot wait. I will definitely be playing that. So I welcome you all to watch me play that when it comes out. And I can't look wait for it. I'm looking forward to it. I did see on there, though, it did look like it is still going to continue on with Amicia and Hugo. So that's pretty good. It's not like new characters or anything. So I like that. So we can see what happens next in their in their journey so yeah so overall i had a great experience obviously the biggest issues was with the controls with like she wasn't running when she was supposed to and the aiming i get i get it there was no it really wasn't auto aim but at the same time you know like when i was trying to aim at something like it was like pulling me away like the aiming cursor part would go in an opposite direction things like that annoyed me so i really hope they fix that for this next game. I hope, like, I, I haven't looked into anybody else playing in this game, so I have no clue if anybody else struggled the way I did. So I don't know if it's just me sucking at the game, or if that was a common issue. I'm gonna probably look that up on my own time, and I may bring it up when the second one comes out. I just want to make sure I say everything about this game that I want to say, but at the same time I feel like I'm just rambling and rambling. Um... Because this is the last time I'm going to talk about this specific game, at least until the second one comes out. So that's why I'm, pro yeah, that's why I'm like rambling. I want to make sure I say everything. So, so to everybody that was involved in making this game, great, great job. Last apologies. Last time I'm going to say my apologies for all the complaints that I had. But um, yeah, obviously, like I said, I wasn't going to blame myself. I have to blame everybody but me. And to everybody that's watched this, I, I really hope you enjoyed it, and you were able to tolerate me and my issues throughout the whole series. So I will see you all again for the continuation of the Hugo Amicia saga, and in the meantime, have a great day. See you next time.